HPA. The patient is a seven-year-old white female who is accompanied by her mother, period. She is referred by her pediatrician for the evaluation of allergic chronitis and asthma, period. She has had both for the last three years, according to the mother, period. She has had no previous allergy evaluation, period. She takes over-the-counter Benadryl PRN, period. Sometimes she also takes other medications such as Claritin, period. The symptoms are present perennial without seasonal change, period. Sometimes the symptoms are worse outdoors, period. No specific triggers identified by the family, period. The family has a cat and a dog, period. The cat sleeps in the child's bedroom sometimes, period. The parents smoke but always outside the house and outside the car, according to the mother, period. She has been to urgent care for sinus infections about two times in the last six months, period. These episodes were treated with amoxicillin for 10 days each, period. She has had no ENT evaluation, period. Next paragraph. The patient has the following symptoms, colon, itchy and watery eyes, comma, runny nose, comma, sneezing, comma, stuffy and congested nostrils, comma, post nasal drainage and cough, and sometimes fullness of the ears, period. She got treated for ear infections much more frequently when she was younger, period. She had one set of tympanostomy tubes placed at that time, period. Her hearing is normal, period. Her speech is not impaired, period. New paragraph. The asthma symptoms include cough, comma, wheezing, and sharpness of breath, period. They are present mostly during winter months, period. The mother has not identified any specific trigger for asthma also, period. However, following upper respiratory tract infection, she gets bronchitis episodes, which are treated with antibiotics by the primary care physician, period. Exercise, such as running and playing outdoors, makes the symptoms worse, period. She also coughs during the night, period. She has never been hospitalized for asthma, period. She went to the emergency room about twice, in the last one year for acute asthma exacerbations, period. She has no history of eczema, period. She is not allergic to foods, comma, medications, comma, stinging insects or latex, period. Review of systems is otherwise negative, period. Physical exam. Enter a physical examination. Allergen testing report. I recommend immediate hypersensitivity skin test for common aero allergens and food allergens for this patient, period. My office will try to get authorization from the insurance before the procedure is done, period. The patient should stop antihistamine for at least 10 days before the skin test, period. Next paragraph. I also recommend pulmonary function test with and without albuterol, period. The patient gives history suggestive of allergic chronitis and asthma, period. I recommend allergy evaluation and asthma testing as above, period. In the meantime, I recommend the family members strictly smoke outside the house and outside the car, period. The animals should not sleep in the child's bedroom, period. Other allergy control measures discussed with the family in detail, period. Printed information is given in this regard, period. More recommendations will be made once allergy evaluation is completed, period. Select motor, more. Go to the end of sentence. Undo that. In the meantime, I recommend normal saline nasal wash once daily 
gamma-fluticasone nasal spray, 1-2 sprays each nostril daily, and loratadine 10 mg daily, period. The right technique of using fluticasone is demonstrated to the family, period. Importance of giving medications regularly as prescribed is emphasized, period. The antihistamine tablet will, will be withheld by the family until the allergy testing is completed, period. Sorry, because I'm going to stop it. The patient completed CBC with the differential, comma, sedimentation rate, comma, comprehensive metabolic panel, comma, urine analysis <coughs> with microscopy, comma, CH50, comma, serum quantitative immunoglobulins, comma, humor aluminum panel, Kama HIV-1 and 2 antibody screen, Kama acute hepatitis panel, Kama serum protein electrophoresis, Kama serum beta-2 microglobulin, and lymphocyte profile, period. Select provider, choose one. She has normal CD3, Kama CD4, Kama CD8, numbers and ratios, period. The CBC with the differential is also normal, period. Comprehensive metabolic panel shows slightly increased glucose, 108, open bracket, normal, 65, hyper 99, close the bracket, comma, UN, 26, open bracket, normal, 6, hyphen 24, close the bracket, comma, serum creatinine, 1.22, Open bracket, normal 0 0.57, iPhone 1, close the bracket. Calcium reduced, 7.8, open bracket, normal 8.7, iPhone 10.2, close the bracket. And AST slightly increased, 41, open bracket, normal 0, iPhone 40, close the bracket. Period. She has normal serum protein electrophoresis, period. She has normal IgG subclasses, period. The HIV-1 and 2 antibody screen was negative, period. The acute hepatitis panel also was negative, period. IG RAS for latex was negative, period. Serum IgE is normal, period. She has normal humoral immune panel, comma ANA screen, comma sedimentation rate, and rest of the immunoglobulins, period. Beta-2 microglobulin level is raised, 2.7, open bracket, normal 0.6, iPhone 2.4, close the bracket, period. The results are discussed with the patient by phone today, period. The patient agreed to keep the follow-up appointment as arranged, period. Further recommendations will be made at that time, period. That is the end of my dictation, period. Repeat, serum quantitative immunoglobulins in three months period.